Hey what's up guys, before I get into this video, if you want cheap and reliable games, head to g2a.com, link in the description below. Right now you can get CSGO for around $8.50, so go there, and it helps me out as well as helping out the channel. Now I'll see you in the video. Hey what's up guys, hgirl52 here, and welcome to um, my tutorial on how to install my PvP um, mod pack, as well as exposing it to the open. So as you can see... This is my pack. I've got right. You can see my mini map. This is Voxel's mini map. Top center, you can see direction hard. And let's see if I. What do I have as the sprint key here, real quick? Grave. If you can see, if I press. That's not grave. That's escape. Grave, yeah, I have sprint toggled, which is toggle sprint. In the bottom left, I have armor hard. And if I drink a part real quick you can see I have potion effects as well as optifine so if you want this sick mod pack go to the link and download that um, file it should be on a media file and I'll get into tutorial on how to install it see you then what's up guys hgirl52 here and welcome to my installation guide for um, my Minecraft PvP mod pack. So what you're gonna want to do to install this is you're gonna want to open up this, the mod pack that you get. Um, you're gonna want to extract it first, but for the purpose of the so you would do this, but for the purposes of this video, I'm not going to extract it. Then you're gonna want to open up mods, copy this, and then. In this folder, if you have already gone to mods folder because you've already installed a mod, good job. But otherwise, you're going to want to go new and make a file called mods. From there, you just want to open this up and copy and I mean and paste what you have from here, or you can drag it. And then the next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to installers here, double click forge. And that's gonna come up with an applicate and uh mix up with my own words here. An application and you're gonna wanna make sure it's on install client. Then click OK and it will install um Minecraft Forge. Now the issue is that gives you everything, all the mods apart from um Zan's minimap. So if you don't want Zan's minimap, you can stop now, but then what you're gonna do to get Zam's minimap as well, you wanna click light loader installer. See where it says extend from? You're gonna wanna make sure that is on 1.8 forge. Then click OK. And then that's successfully installed. Now the last step you just have to open Minecraft. And this is the easiest step right here. It's a pretty much a really easy guide. If you want another guide, this one's not working for you or something, check out the description below and it has um, a written version of how to install it. It might be different on a Mac since I don't use a Mac, but this is how to install it on a Windows. So what you want to do is you want to click new profile, call it whatever you want. I'm going to call it PvP Mods Paco or whatever. Pizco, then you're gonna wanna f you'll, you'll probably be on use latest release if you don't install mods. So what you're gonna do wanna do is you're gonna wanna scroll down and find this one, light loader with forge. Say profile. Then find it. There it is. Open this one up. And then. Yeah, it should. It has to install a few things, but it should go pretty fast. So we go there, and this should have all your mods installed, pretty easily. Pretty easy. You can see it's creating some files right here. You create a Voxels pack folder as well, and when it loads up, knowing my luck, could probably crash the computer and give me blue screen glitch, but um. See light mod folder, and then these ones are all Forge. So as I said before, it features toggle sprint, optifine status effects, direction HUD, and armor status. These 
um, are just required to install these other ones. So I installed this just for um, just to make it easier for you guys. I know some of you are not very good with installing mods. It's quite easy. If we didn't know how to extract the zip file, just go on the internet and Google how to extract a zip file and they'll tell you to get 7-zip. And if you haven't got 7-zip, it's free. Just type in 7-zip on your um, web browser and you can go download it. So, real quick when it loads, see Voxels mod. And if I go into Furious PvP, and one thing you're going to want to do once you've done this, just to protect yourself from any um, bad things that could happen, you're going to want to click Escape. Actually, you're going to want to click M. First, get rid of that M. Where it says Radar, you're going to turn this off. Because Radar is generally banned on servers. So... Yeah, so if you use Radar, then... It's pretty um, bad for you because you could get banned. Most servers, including Furious PvP, what I'm playing on right now. Raider is not allowed. Um, but anyway, as you can see, I have toggle sprint top left over the top of my thing. I have armor um, status on the bottom left. I have the minimap top right, and I should have direction hard middle top. And if I drink a potion, I'd have potion effects, but I don't. So, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure to share it with your friends and your mom. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure to like as well. Bye.